<laughs> hey, what's up, everyone, and welcome to another reaction video for today. And I'm here to watch a ethereal snake video. Of course, I just watched the Jesus video. Of course, the true story, the E true Hollywood story of uh, Jesus, <laughs> what actually happened. Um, dude, I'm not gonna lie. I actually watched that video a few days ago, as of recording this video right now. Um, so it's actually been a few days since I watched it. I put it up yesterday, but I watched it a few days ago, and it, it was like stuck in. Not stuck, it was just like in limbo or whatever. So, uh, this one is another Ethereal Snake video, obviously. Uh, this is Thomas Was Only Following Orders. Um, I know I have to watch the Mickey videos. I had a couple of people tell me, like, you need to watch the Mickey videos, which I'm like, alright, I got <laughs> I guess I gotta. So, Thomas Was Only Following Orders from Ethereal Snake. Link in the description. Thought this would be a good one to watch right after. And then I'll do the Mickey ones in the future, but, uh. There's, there's a boy Thomas. It's funny. I just I'm watching this right after watching Bullet Train, which has a a, a pro Thomas the Tank Engine uh, message to it. I wasn't expecting that. Anyway, let's go. Three, wait, hold on. Three, two, one, play. <laughs> yeah, that's yeah. <laughs> God damn. <laughs> God damn. Right. <laughs> 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 Holy shit. It's actually really cinematic. <laughs> I have a really dark sense of humor. Oh fuck. Oh, he's crying. What's up? What's wrong, boy? <laughs> oh, God. Jesus Christ. <laughs> That's the Thomas Tank Engine was only following words. It was just a job. Oh no. <laughs> the trains are always on time. All I want was to be a useful engine. Useful engines always arrive on time. Useful engines follow orders. <laughs> this video gave the phrase it was time for Thomas to leave. He had seen everything in different meaning. Is likely executed for helping the Nazis in the Holocaust and Mickey Mouse, Donald Duck, and Goofy all served in the Vietnam War. Oh, is that what the Mickey Mouse videos are about? I saw the thumbnail. <laughs> so, yeah. Thomas always wondered why he never got any return. <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> smoke always in under ten sequences, you're able to tell a story that takes zero explanation with zero words. That, that is our... Yeah, it, it, you know what? <laughs> Thomas still carries that what their weight, yeah. <laughs> Good lord, that's really tough. <laughs> oh fuck! I, like I'm sure I'm like the only person out there that laughed at that immediately. It's, it's so dark to start off with. <laughs> with Thomas the tension engine at the Nuremberg trials, some laughed, some cried, most were silent. I laughed. And then I was silent. <laughs> I guess it was two of them. I didn't cry yet. I'm not gonna lie, that was some legitimately impressive visual storytelling. Yeah, no, that really was. It's fucking three o'clock in the morning, and as it usually is when I record these. Combination of music, color palette, and scenery makes you feel the infernal and the human nature of World War II better than any many feature films. I express my respect for the author. This is true art. How he manages to to make something like legitimately good like that. Oh, thank God the Nuremberg trial explained. I like how the Nuremberg trial I guess it's probably in the description, right? I like how it wasn't referenced in the title. But that popped up anyway. Um Alright, well there you go. That is uh Thomas was only following orders. Like that comment said, fantastic. Fan Fantastic storytelling.
Uh, it did make me laugh in the beginning, uh, only because of how fucked up it was to start with. Uh, and then I quickly realized it was not supposed to be funny. Am I ashamed of laughing? I mean, I was only doing a job.